Now, commuters in Lagos are still groaning over the lingering fuel scarcity, which has resulted in long queues at various filling stations as well as hike in transport fares. Now, Plus TV News correspondent Emmanuel Odubobo confirms the pools of restaurants and what they have to go through to get the product. His report. The long fur queues have been persistent since late 2022. Alarmingly, the situation has not abated in the wake of the new year. As work resumes, one thing is visible. The vehicular traffic, which the state is known for, is yet to be seen. However, residents are not happy with the state of affairs as the fuel crisis is simply unending. It is very, very difficult to get fuel. But really, I, I actually don't know what is causing it anyway. But you know, in Nigeria, wherever they push us, that's where we'll go. Simply because we are used to the suffering that we, all of us are facing. Both the BU, the rich, poor and the rest people. It's not a very good idea. Uh, is is because it seems like the people in charge of the of, uh, of the of the fuel are like they are holding the fuel so that by the time things are now maybe now uh, quite difficult they will now release and sell at a higher price. The lamentations continue as the first casty usually takes its toll on economic activities. Unsurprisingly, transport fares and prices of commodities are skyrocketed. Looking at the transport system this morning, uh, because I, I, I stepped out this morning for my job, and um, I entered from Aja to, to Falomoye, yeah? 400. I think it's a bit lesser now. It's been up for like, for since this first scarcity started, since December, it's been so high. Like now, from here, from this uh, Falomo roundabout, so Lakwe is 1,000 naira. Before you can get it 500, 600, but now 1,000 naira. Except you beg and beg and beg before they can collect 800 naira. That is if you if you meet a nice people. Transport price is still the way it is. Because if you ask the transporter, they will ask you, they will tell you it's because of the fuel. The price that buy fuel. And to me, from my experience, um, even the government also said they don't know anything about fuel. I mean, they have not increased fuel and out there. As many bask in the euphoria of commuting freely to work this period, others believe the joy will be short-lived as the traffic situation will get jammed in a week. Transport right now, uh, concerning traffic, no traffic, everywhere is normal. No, no traffic is normal because you know, by this time people are still on holidays, people traveled and the road, is, the road is a bit free, it's very free now. Maybe from next week by the weekend people will start resuming back to work. Many independent marketers are selling between 220 naira and 240 naira per litre at different locations, while major marketers still sell the product at about 175 naira per litre, leaving long queues extending outside their gates. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.